Jesus might have had dreads. John the Baptist definitely did. Come on. Locusts, honey, camel's hair, wilderness, long time. Didn't care about a comb, guaranteed. He would look matted up and... Repent! Oh, man. No, it was weird. Uh, years ago, God spoke to me when I first got born again. He said, I want you to grow dreads. <sighs> okay, my wife. You know, whoa. Now she's good. But I asked her the other day, do you want me to cut them off? She goes, why? This is why. God said, I want you to grow them because I want you to break the stereotypical mindset off of the bride. That's awesome. Because God looks at the heart, and sometimes we look at a book and we judge it by its... I come into churches, and I'm the speaker. Sometimes, you know. And I come in, and I, I sit in the back a lot, you know. I just worship Jesus, man. I mean, I love sitting with pastors. It's awesome. But I love just, man, I'm just to worship Jesus and give him glory. And sometimes people are like, oh, man, that guy, you see that guy just came in, a new guy? Man, he needs Jesus. We're going to get him saved today. <laughs> and then I come up and speak, and they're like, Whoa. Come on. It's time we, how are you gonna how are you gonna be a good witness if we look at people wrong? Now I started to try to get into it in first service and I couldn't get there, but I tried to. And it says in Second Corinthians five, it says, Therefore we regard no one according to the flesh. <laughs> 